Welcome back. I'm here with our musical guest tonight, Chaparral. Guys, thanks for being here. Our thanks pleasure. For having us. So to start off, I want to hear the story behind the name Chaparral. Well, it's actually the street that my parents live on, and we all decided on it because we wanted something to to remind us how to come home and, and remember who you are and where you come from. So what better place than, you know, a street that you grew up on. Good, I like that. Um, so um, tell me a little bit about the musical genre, because I know it's country and a little bit of rock. I explain a little bit about that. Joseph? Um, as far as songwriting goes, it's it's real deeply rooted in old, old country, you know, Merle Haggard, Buck Owens. But um, a lot of us are rock and roll players, too, as far as our guitar work and stuff like that. So it kind of makes this whole new subgenre country rock, I guess. That's the best way I could describe it. Wonderful. And so um, I know you guys have been playing a lot locally and also uh, out of town. Tell me some of the venues that you've played. Well, here in town, we've hit up a couple of bar venues as well as local rodeos. We've hit Clovis Rodeo, Springville Rodeo. We have Woodlake this weekend. A couple of the bar venues include um, Jimbo's as well as we've been invited to Crossroads, which is in downtown um, Old Town Clovis. And uh, that's just locally here. And then we got to play here at Fresno State as well, great. which was I got to catch awesome. that. That was great. Yeah, really it was a that. great experience. Great. And then also, I heard that you were you played at the World Ag Expo with somebody that was kind of a big deal. So yeah, that was. Let's hear uh, about that. Who was that? That was definitely a dream come true. Our CD release party got to be a part of the World Ag Expo's um, first annual Concerts for a Cause, and the first night was with Blake Shelton. Uh, he's had an amazing year, and um, it was just a great privilege to actually play with him. And then the second night, we got to play with David Nail, um, who is an upcoming artist and has a couple of hits out on the radio as well. So, um, and just awesome to be a part of it because of the fact that all the proceeds went back to agriculture awareness. So. That's great. And you guys have a CD out now, which I am very aware because I have it in my car and I've had it for the last couple <laughs> weeks in my car listening to it. Yeah. What is your favorite song? Both of you, what's your favorite song? Ooh, um, my, okay, and my personal favorite has to be uh, Should Have uh, Left Me. Uh, it's <laughs> it kind of a, it hits home for me. I, I had a hand in writing it and it was about an ex-boyfriend that, shame on him, so. Uh, <laughs> But that has to be my favorite. Great. And Joseph? Um, is, I'm going to be, you know, I'm going <laughs> to like my own songs. Please so. do. Great. <laughs> uh, on the record, I love The Fall. Yes. It's a kind of a slower song. It's about a, a guy's life being changed by a woman. And it's, it's a really cool song. And I just love the way it turned out on the record. Oh, I'm so glad. And I, I've enjoyed listening to it. It's great. You guys do great stuff, and I'm so excited that you're here today. So thank, thank you, you so much. And uh, we'll be back in just a moment with more music from Chaparral, so stick around. Mm -hmm. 